Okay, greetings ladies and folks. Welcome to a video of me getting rid of some crap. Or at least showing off a bunch of crap that I need to get rid of. One way or another. Well, not one way or another. <sighs> These need to be sold. That's what I'm saying. So I'm going to give you a little demonstration. Show off a bunch of stuff that I need to part ways with in exchange for monetary values. And uh, we'll see how it goes from there. I've got a. I got quite a few items. Mostly stuff that is boxed that I just have never really needed. But yeah, there's going to be a few uh, loose items uh, mostly mostly transformer stuff so if you don't care about transformers and uh, go ahead and turn around right now uh, okay let's start off with the small stuff a bunch of stuff that I just sort of have but don't really have a purpose for so, all right First up to bat, we have, uh, I believe this is Voyager, Revenge of the... F God, stand up, please, if you can. <laughs> Voyager, Revenge of the Fallen, uh, Starscream. Uh, he's missing his, uh, tail fins. No fucking idea what happened to those. Uh, but otherwise, yeah, that's about it. There's no tail fins. Uh, I think I got them at a garage sale or something. I don't know. My mom, or my mom got it at a garage sale. And, you know, she means well, but uh, she, she didn't know I didn't give a shit. Uh... I absolutely have no idea. It's a movie Optimus Prime of some form. It, it, it's just... It's kind of Revol Tech-ish. I'm trying to remember. I look this up, but every time I look it up, I completely forget what it is. Immediately after. But it's a non-transforming Optimus Prime figure of some form. Probably first movie... Otherwise, I have no idea. Uh, what are these things? I don't know. It's a tank. It does a thing. It becomes brawl. Uh, I'm not asking much, if anything, for these. Like, I got them... I, like, I think all three of these came from a yard sale or a rummage sale or something. And they're just things that I have that I just don't have any place for. I don't, I don't, I don't want them. And I don't want them. So there's that. Uh, something slightly more uh, upscale on the interesting, something, something slightly more interesting, I think, uh, Generations GDO Deluxe Swerve? Yeah, I, I don't know. I'm trying to remember why I got this in the first place. I think it was just a case of... Oh, there's so many swerves out there. We'll just get this one swerve, and then uh, IDW happened, and then IDW figures of swerve happened, and then I got one of them, and now I don't really need or care to own this one anymore. So it's in pretty good condition. Uh, no, in no instructions, again. But uh, I guess if you're looking for some, I don't know, an iron hide alike, it turns into a red pickup truck. That'll do ya. And... What is this? 
Dark of the Moon, Revenge of the Fall, something or other. Uh, movie Power Glide. I'm actually, I was actually slightly tempted not to part ways with this figure because this is actually a pretty good uh, Power Glide figure, and it's very good A10 model, but. Uh, I have Combiner Wars Power Glide. So yeah, uh, these are uh, superfluous. And uh, they gotta go. Not asking for much. They're both no instructions, no boxes, no nothing. So Alright, time to get into some box stuff. This one might be... Uh, pleasing to you if you're a Gundam fan. Uh, I have Mobile Suit Gundam G-Frame Volume 6. Uh, Gundam Ground Type. Both the frame and the armor. And the G-05. Both the frame and the armor all together. Now these things, uh, they're kind of... If you're into mobile suit and action, uh, these are around about the same scale as those, just, just ever so slightly bigger. So if you're interested in these, uh, they're actually pretty darn good figures and pretty good desk toys. I have, uh, they came in, you know, they're the candy toys box set. These two are extras that I just need to offload because I already have the other ones that I want. All right, I'm going to have to get up out of my chair to go pick up the rest of this content because it's over on the bed. Uh, okay. Next thing's up for grabs, and these ones are actually very important because I actually very much need need my money back on both of these. The Transformer Cybertron, War for Cybertron Trilogy, Decepticon Hotlink. I got two of these because I thought I was doing some people some favors, but uh, apparently they never followed up on that. I don't know. Not calling anyone out. I'm just saying I thought I was doing some favors for some people, and I spent money on these things that wasn't mine to spend. And I need that money back as soon as freaking possible, so... Yeah, and no, I am not, no deals on these. I, you, it, full price. Full price or more. These both have to be paid back in full. And they have to be bought. There's no trade option on this. Not that I'm asking for anything in trade during this video anyway. But that's an absolute must requirement of these specific items. Uh, okay, do I get the rest of the stuff off of the bed? No, I'll go through this box instead. I have not opened this box in forever, so I have no clue. Alright, let's see. What do we have? Oh, God. Ah. This might be... In this might be enticing to some people. Uh, Transformers, Prime, Robots, in Disguise, Viacons. MIB. Let's see, how many do I have? Do I have just the two? No, I have three. Alright, so I have three uh, Viacons up for grabs. Again, just one of those things. I was planning to army build these, but I've long since lost my luster for such things. And it's just, again, I need, I need money more than I need an army of vehicons. So, right to the side. Let's pull out something else here. What is this, just a one? Yeah, it is. Generations Warpath. 
I don't know what else to say. It's the Deluxe Generations Warpath. For anyone who wants the Deluxe Generations Warpath, uh, I have no idea what I why I got a double of these. So whatever. Do 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 do. Who is up for grab for next? Why do it again? I have two of these. Why do I have two of these? I'm sure there's a reasonable explanation, but. Sergeant Cup! You know, more pickup trucks. Uh, I can understand not wanting these in the face of the Titan's Return version, but at least you don't have to remove the head on this one. Granted, you might want to, considering the face on this. Actually, I think I have a spare eye gear head laying around somewhere. Can't guarantee that, but... There you go. Who's next on the list of bucket? What is this? Oh, that is terrible. Okay, um... Animated... Activator's Ratchet. I think this was just a plain Jane mistake. Like, I wanted to get the Deluxe Ratchet and ended up with the Activator one instead. And, uh... I eventually got the regular ratchet, so I yeah, there's no point in holding on to this. Uh, I am tempted to just give this way as a freebie because I know no one's gonna want this. Universe Galvatron is uh, awful thing. <laughs> okay, I don't hate him. But then again, I don't like Galvatron, so I don't care. Like, I'm sorry for anyone out there who's a big fan of the Big G. It's not for me. Alright, what else have we got on this box that I can offload on? Okay, this is interesting. <laughs> uh... I think this is just from the first Transformers movie. Like, I thought it was All Spark or something. Like, I don't know. Dropkick! The one that turns into a pickup truck. Still blue, interestingly enough. Or purple, depending on... It looks blue to me in this lighting. Either way, it's Dropkick. Who, I think... Wasn't they... Weren't they a character in the Bumblebee movie? And they were a blue car or something? I don't know. Either way. La -di -da -di -da 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 I don't know who's that interested in this, but that could be, you know, an army builder for junkions if you need them. But that's uh, reveal the shield, Gar of the Wrecking Ness. Nope. Thought I had a couple for some reason, but uh, one wreck gar, reveal a shield. It's uh, not a great figure, but again, if you want junkions, it's a way to fill out uh, junkion rings. So, there you go. Okay. What the heck? Oh, I marked over this. Don't want to see the price tag. Ah, two. I know there's a, the new Wheeljack that's out for Earthrise, so these might not be p completely tempting, but... Uh, just from a visual standpoint, at least in robot mode, I definitely prefer this Wheeljack. Uh, personally, I, it's, like, there's nothing about the new Wheeljack that's enticing enough for me to want to replace my existing one, and... I have two more, so if anyone else has similar sentiments to me about Wheeljack, yeah, there's a couple of them for you. Do, 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 do. Back into the box. What have we got? Oh, my lord. 
My lord, lord, my, my lord, lord of my. Anyone like sweeps? Generation Scourge times two. Another case of uh, uh, once considered army building, but in hindsight, uh, I need space and I need money more than I need sweeps on my shelf. Is there anything else in the box? I thought I saw something else. Was there something else? Oh, wait. Sorry. Wasn't two. It was three. So, three scourges if you want to sweep that one up. Ha 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 ha. Alright. Um, still, just the one thing. Okay, yeah. Oof. Probably not very valuable in the eyes of people who are now looking at the current line of War for Cybertron Seekers, but there is Generations, Classics, Mold, Deluxe, Thundercracker. He's, he's not great, but he's okay. I like the deeper blue, personally. But, uh... Uh, yeah. That's it for grabs. The big box is empty. Now I'm gonna have to walk over to the bed. Ugh. And grab these things. Revenge of the Fallen Blue John. The uh, Voyager one that turns into a skeleton samurai guy. Makes for a good classics bludgeon. Maybe not a great classics bludgeon, but... Oop. Hit the lamp. The lamp! And... Yeah. I think this is another mistake. Steak. I got an extra one of these. I already got a Voyager Optimus Prime, and I don't need another one. So, there. Voyager Animated Optimus Prime. I can vouch for him. He's good. If you want animated on your shelf, uh, there's an option for you. Um, anyone here Sonic fans? Anyone? I don't know. The, uh... 10-inch Toys R Us exclusive Metal Sonic. These things didn't have the best QC. I don't think. But, uh... I mean, he's alright. If you like... I like Metal Sonic, so, yeah. And, uh... It's Toys R Us exclusive... A place that no longer exists in the continental U.S. of A. Okay. So that's up for grabs. Now back to the bed. Yeah, I can't make it sound like a thump. Anyway. It's going to make it sound like a thump because this audio fell asleep. Okay, now for some of the big guns, the big items, the big things that people will actually uh, maybe take an interest in. Uh, this one disappoints me so much. Transformers Timelines Overrun, the, uh, the black of the, 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 the him, that one. Not racist, I swear. 
But, uh, yeah. I only got this one. This is from the year, I believe, when the Transformers Collectors Club had some sort of uh, leak with their credit card numbers. And uh, because of that, I was not inclined to actually renew my subscription in order to get his companion... Uh, Run a muck, run a run about. I don't, the the that one, the white one. So it's just him. I'll show you. I can get this thing open. Only ever open this thing a couple times. Yep. Just him there. Technical data, and a cutout thing for the second guy. He would go in here if you had him, but since I don't have him, of course not. So, I don't know. If someone else has the white one but not the black one, they can hit me up. And you can have this one. For a pretty penny. I don't care, just so long as it's out of my side. I don't, f I don't, I don't want it. Um, la di da di da di da. Ah. Timelines. Eraser. Not actually one of the best figures ever. Uh, it's that, that weird double cockpit thing. But uh, yeah, if anyone was interested. In the pre-Earth mode air riser thing. Uh, yeah, there you go. And now for the big gun. Something that uh, probably won't excite, but is probably the most I have to offer. And again, I do require be taken off of my hands. We have Transformers Timelines Astro Train with Starcatcher, Astro Hook, Astro Line, and Astro Sinker Minicons. Basically, a uh, uh, new head on top of the Armada Jetfire mold, which was kind of a brick and meant to be a pair of pants for another Optimus Prime. But, uh, he is in there, and he is pretty, pretty, pretty good. Uh, do the electronics still work? I have not touched this thing since I got it. I, I have another one, which is why I'm get off owning this one, but. No, the electronics do not work. I am sorry! Could be. I don't know if that's... Or maybe I'm just doing something wrong. Or maybe I took the batteries out. I'm not sure. I think taking the batteries out would be the smart thing. Either way, you'll want this. He's actually... Oh, God, no. It's a pretty okay, decent thing pretty big you know, so if you want yourself a nice big astro train and uh, that is all astro and no train there you go and ba -ba -da -ba -ba -da -ba -da -ba. i think that is is that everything yeah for now that is everything i have to show off for you to Sorry about the microphone there. For you to potentially drop some dosh on and support me. Especially these guys. Because again, I wasn't supposed to buy these, so I need my money back. It's very tenuous. Well, maybe not that tenuous. It's, it's a stupid situation regarding these things. And I have two of them, so... Someone, please step forward and <laughs> buy them from me. And in order to do so, 
you want to get into contact with me in order to arrange a purchase haggle prices or what have you except for these these things i'm not haggling on you've got to pay full price or higher uh The quickest and easiest way to get a hold of me is through Discord. I will put my Discord username somewhere in the description, and you can friend, you can look me up, friend me, and we'll start making uh, the ex we'll start working on dealing how how to deal with the exchange, and then exchange how we're supposed to get it paid for. If you don't have Discord, then send me a private message through YouTube so that I can give you my email address. I am not going to openly hand out my email address here, and I don't want to do a transaction through my private messages either. So just give me a private message requesting, you know, a transaction. I will give you my email address, and then from the email, we can make the arrangements from there. So, God, I don't know what else to say. Hopefully, you're enticed to take some of this stuff off my hands. If none of the stuff here entices you, but you still want to support me in some way, I will also leave a link to my Amazon wish list in the description as well. If nothing on, if you don't want to support my Am through me, if my Amazon wish list does not entice you to get anything from me either, but you still want to support me, well, spread the word, spread news around, tell people, hey, there's a bunch of stuff that this internet guy wants to get rid of. If you're interested in it, you know, just spread the word. If nothing else, just spread the word around that this guy needs to offload some of his crap. And, uh, yeah. So, thank you all for watching. Um, uh, RCFS and out.